All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm 21 the Bearded Wonder. I'm going to be your shoutcaster tonight. We're going to start off the round very nicely with a headshot from Reaper going on to Fandolf. Meanwhile, Error going to get a market gardener on to Cattletail. Going to be jumping around the camera a little bit. It looks like a spy going in, taking down Reaper. No, he's got the Jurati on him, and it looks like he might be running for his life. No, it's going to be taking him down with a nice headshot. And a uh, very good job by him. Meanwhile, we have the blue heavy cats going to be jumping around with maybe the family business. Just being that fat scout. Going to see what cats can do. She's been known to be a complete and utter terror for the noobs on the server. See the red team trying to push out. Now blue team putting some capture time. That's going to be casually gaming. Fandolf and cats there. But the red devil man throwing down some stickies. Picking up one kill. Looks like Cat's going to be trying to escape, getting knocked down to low health, casually gaming, also very low, but trying to take on this Devilman, who's also at very low health. He's going to not make it into the house in time. Going to be taking down Fidel Castro's Cabbage Garden there. It's going to be casually gaming. And we see Aaronic trying to jump in and falling to his death. I believe there might have been some mini sentry nonsense involved. Meanwhile, Red Team putting a lot of capture time on. They have two scouts on there, getting that times five with the pyro assist. It's going to be Sully and Sauce. Very good name combination there. Meanwhile, we have a Red Scout going in on the Blue Scout. That's going to be Jufro trying to take out Project White Boy. Going to be taking him down with that scatter gun. Does this improve it? <laughs> now, meanwhile, we do have Vlon Dillon going to be dropping those mini sentries for the Blue Team. Just doing some nonsense. And uh, we do have Springs Mr. Maniac going to be running right into that Wrangled Mini Sentry. Not really sure what he's going to be able to do with this. It looks like he's getting the spam, but it's not very effective. And we do see the spy coming in. Am I the one lagging or are you guys lagging? I really need to know. Meanwhile, we do have two C's on the control point doing some nonsense. He's going to be trying to capture it, using that rocket launcher to take down Fandolf before being incinerated by Fandolf as well. Meanwhile, Van Bam going to be jumping on the point with those revenge crits. Red team, watch out. A blue soldier just fell through the roof. I believe Reaper going to be taking him down with that body shot. And uh, this is Engineer on fire. Not sure if he's going to make it to the health pack in time. No, is uh, Fidel Cash are going to be taking him down there. Meanwhile, a lot of frags going to blue team. Cat's getting a glove kill using those crazy, uh, I don't even remember what those are called at this point. Those crazy boxy gloves going to be watching what Cat's is doing, running through the house. And this could be the opportunity we're waiting for. Cat's going on the point, trying to put a stop to it. But the pyro and the demo man are going to be blasting cats around. Cat, she's not going to be able to do anything there. Jufro cleaning up the kill. A time seven for the red team, and they're going to take it back. This has just been a back and forth game between these two teams. Team Panda Apocalypse on the red, and Team Trees Taste Yummy on the blue. We're going to have Linux Penguin on the roof. Sturdy going to be trying to do stuff. But uh, just going to be taking down Fidel Castro and Sully just combining to do utter nonsense and just wrecking everyone in this house. Jufro coming in to assist. So red team just with the superior damage at the moment. And we do see an oblect inspector going to be waiting for his health back. He's building that power with the gibbous, interesting enough. So just trying to intimidate his foes. Looks like red team getting some spawn camping on. We'll see how long they can keep it up, though. So we do have this blue soldier casually gaming, jumping on the roof, trying to take him out. But no, not going to happen. Is Fidel Castro going to be pistoling him down? Uh, Jesus. The control point is being captured. Now, meanwhile, we're going to be jumping back into action. Sorry for that little break as we do have Monster going to be Moister, actually. 60 going to be trying to get the spawn. Not going to happen, taking way too much damage. We do have this Red Soldier on the roof, and now he's off the roof. Fonzik going to be taking him down with that buckshot into his behind quarters, also known as the Patuckus, the Anus region. Now the red team does have stickies all the control point. The Devman detonating and taking down Valen Devan. Going to be defending it and red team definitely winning that round. Good, good. 
Now I'm going to be watching the Grand Master as he's going to be running, jumping out, doing a triple jump right off the bat. He does have that market gardener, but he's getting surrounded by the scouts. The scouts all over is Badonk and Donk, and I'm not sure if he's going to be able to escape in time. No, he's actually going to make it to the health pack. Meanwhile, Spriggs Maniac going to be getting a double kill with those stickies and... Reaper getting a nice hatch on the Grandmaster. Moister going to be running for his life, but the sniper is the sniper rifle and takes him down with a body shot. Now we're going to be jumping around. We do have Fonzik trying to camp those red players. Going to be taking down the scout, but Jufro cleaning him up in return does not like all that spawn camping that's going on. And we're going to see two C's jumping about doing what that soldier be do. He walks in, sees the pyro, and my game is lagging. Here we go. Now we do have two C's taking out the blue medic or trying to. He ran out of rockets, but it doesn't matter. Jufro's got his back getting a double kill right there. Second kill onto that blue medic. I'm going to be jumping on the Jufro camera as he's jumping roll over that soldier. Did not get the kill, but still doing a lot of damage to him. He does see these blue players now trying to help capture the point. Scare off that little scout, so uh, doing a great job there. Now he's jumping all over this heavy weapons guy. This blue heavy weapons guy is so disoriented. He's confused. Somebody needs to keep his head from spinning. And Jufro is just going to escape with his life. Meanwhile, the black inspector is going to be going in. Walks right past that red scout. Not going to be doing damage to him. Just caring about capturing it at the moment. Now we're going to see a Black Spectre joined by all these blue players. Meanwhile, Spriggs Manic going to be going in with a lock and load, getting headshotted down by the Grandmaster. And we see a Black Inspector going to be jumping down. He's always at low health, it seems. He Whoa! Walks right past that spy. That spy going to be stabbing down Fandolf. Somehow the medic for the blue team still alive did not get hunted down by that red spy. But no, there we go. Distracting Paradox going to be taking down Moister right there. I'm going to be jumping around. Moister, very disappointed about that. Meanwhile, Tast is going to be on the red team. I almost want to say Taste, and he's going to be just, you know, pulling out that sniper rifle, having a little bit of fun time. You know what I mean, Mom? I mean, he's going to be seeing that blue soldier trying to take him out with a headshot. Not going to happen. Can he get an air snipe? No, he misses it, unfortunately. I would love to see that. And we're going to be skipping around to the angry German. Hopefully no keyboards will be harmed in this gaming session. It looks like Angry German just flipping out for a second. His mouse just flipping. He walks right into the spy, but I don't know what he's doing. He's just walking around lagging out. So we're going to jump to somebody who's not lagging at 500 miles per hour and see what we can find. We have Reaper trying to spawn camp as a sniper. He does get a nice body shot on the opposing sniper, but he's not going to be able to do anything. You need those headshots at this distance. And we're going to wait as it looks like he wants to pull off an ambush. Put on the sneaky shoes. I do not want to switch from his camera because I'm committed, but it looks like he's given up on that sneaky, sneaky spy play as a sniper, whatever that means. He's going in with the bushwhacker, though. Going to be hunting the dumb one. He takes down the golf club, but no, the pyro cat's going to be coming in to assist. Or, excuse me, I got cats and the pyro mixed up. It's all good anyway. Meanwhile, Fidel Castro's Cabbage Garden going to be looking at the point. Blue team does have the superior capture time at the moment. Red team finally getting another capture of their own there. And they have to run down the clock at least a minute 30 just to tie up the game. You see Fidel Castro's Cabbage Garden just going to be patrolling in the house in the blue shack as he's been doing. Walks right into an enemy soldier. Nice crisper direct rocket right into Oblique Inspector. Now we're going to be jumping around. We found Casually Gaming. He's going to be joining that heavy weapons guy on the control point. Blue team getting the recapture. Red team, you got to get your game together as uh, it's just too much nonsense. He does spot that spy walking right behind him, distracting Paradox. And it looks like he's going to be doing some damage on these red players coming out of the spawn. Now having to go for the health pack. Going to be picking it up just in time. And it uh, looks like he's just going to be hanging out, having some fun. Taken out, distracting Paradox once again. Now getting some damage on the Red Soldier, but taken down himself by Jufro. Now Arxcan is going to be running out. He does have those revenge crits, so Blue Team beware, as he could do some crazy damage with those if the opportunity presents himself. He's going in, tries to hit the scout. One or two crisp direct shots with that crit shotgun going to be taking him down. That's scout all over his but donk a donk as we've previous seen, and somehow his mini sentry gonna be saving his life before Fonzik gonna be taking him down. Now Penguin Master Sturdy 
Mr. Linux going to be taking out the crossbow, trying to stop this scout swarm for the blue team. And it looks like he's just frozen in place and almost incinerated. He's just sitting there. His uber charge is sitting about 70%. Apparently lag is terrible for everyone on the server. I apologize. They do not own the server, so I don't I don't know what to do. And we have Frandolf gonna be rocking the heavy weapons guy for the blue team. He was taking a lot of damage. I don't know from where though, and it looks like he's now gonna be taken down. Mission ends in 60 seconds. Now we're gonna be jumping around. We have Tass putting an end to this blue soldier's market guarder ambitions. That's gonna be Nick going down, unfortunately. Now we're going to see Monster 77 missing the stab on the enemy spy. Now taking out the revolver, trying to get those shots on him. But doesn't matter, his cat's with the lock and load. She's just aiming perfectly and taking down Distracting Paradox there. And we're going to be watching Monster's Cam for a little bit longer. See if he can put a stop to this red counter push. Going to be sap on that mini sentry right there. Walking in, not able to get a stab on any of those red players in point though. The old Grandmaster sees the blue power in the house. And that red power going to be taken down. The blue medic, that's not going to be very helpful for the, for the blue team. They really need that medic to try to make a counter pushes. There's only 30 seconds left until the red team wins. We do have this blue soldier casually gaming trying to get on the control point, but he cannot do it by himself. We're watching Fredoff going to be coming out here just unloading with that minigun, but getting stabbed down by Paradox. Meanwhile, Angry German and the blue medic are going to be coming out on Bleak Inspector. But he's at way low health, and I'm not sure if he's going to be able to push up with the rest of his team. It looks like the rest of his team is indeed falling apart. Blue team, you need this push. You only have 13 seconds left. Actually, you only have three, two, one. And it looks like red team. No, the spy coming on. Nope, red team does win the round.